it was the eeriest of arrivals. This is how the passengers of the Ezzadin made it to Europe. Their ship entered the harbour in silence, in the dark. Dozens stood on deck to catch their first sight of dry land. We're told that everyone's reasonably safe in one piece. Doctors were on board a little earlier. It must have been incredibly cold on board because you can see some of the people have blankets. But now essentially, the journey of these migrants, which would have begun in Syria for some a long time ago, is coming to an end at an Italian port. The Red Cross helped to look after the most vulnerable passengers. They've now been taken to shelters. It must take a certain courage for families to risk the journey across the sea with their youngest children. They're escaping from conflict zones, from persecution, from very severe weather conditions. Winter is very cold, but they didn't stop for bad weather conditions or for the bad condition of the ship. This morning, Icelandic inspectors from the EU's Frontex border force started to search the ship. In daylight, it's easy to tell that the Ezzadin wasn't designed to hold hundreds of passengers. But with the Coast Guard's help, it got them to Europe. James Reynolds, BBC News, Southern Italy.